Dave. <laughs> when it comes to broadacre cropping, machinery is usually big or it's expensive. Sometimes it's both. Which isn't so bad, except a lot of this equipment only gets used for, in very small portions throughout the year for, for performing a specific task. The planter is used for planting, the sprayer is used for spraying, and the harvester is used for harvesting. So when a farmer wants to invest in new machines or new technology, the decision making is massive because the costs are so high and the amortisation of that machine is so low. And in years like this year, where it's been extremely dry, many of this, much of this equipment would not have made it out of the machinery shed. And although it wasn't used, farmers are still obliged to keep up their financial obligations on what that equipment was. So we've developed a system that enables farmers to pay for equipment on a by the hectare rate of how they use it. This gives farmers a known overhead cost per hectare for every hectare it's used on the farm. For the big cropping farmers, it gives them a convenient alternative to conventional finance. And for smaller farmers, it gives them the opportunity to access machinery and technology they would not normally be able to justify by pairing up with other farmers to share equipment to increase the per hectare usage, which decreases the average per hectare cost. The problem is that not all farms are the same. Changes in soil type, weather conditions, grain types mean that a lot of equipment needs to be customised and set up in different ways on different farms to suit that application. So what we really need is a new generation of farming equipment, smart equipment, autonomous that can think for itself, self-sense and adjust itself without the need for internet or cloud connectivity. We are building this equipment. Our first product is a smart planter, a planting system with embedded sensors that is measuring and monitoring the conditions of the soil live while planting. It is making adjustments to the seeding depth and the seeding rate to every part of that farm depending on the conditions of the soil. Now while we don't need internet connectivity for this to work because it is self-sensing, we are still collecting that data which means we know what's going on beneath the soil on every square metre of a farm. That data can also be used to overlay with yield maps. It can be interrogated by agronomists, or more excitingly, used with other smart equipment that we're also developing, such as smart spreaders, smart sprayers, and ultimately, smart autonomous electric tractors. So in the conventional world today, where a farmer may have spent up to $700,000 for a new planter, financed that over five years, what we are offering is a smart planter, fully serviced on farm for potentially as low as $15 per hectare, which is a really attractive alternative. So where we kicked off this project with a new planter, what we now have is a whole ecosystem of a new generation of smart equipment and smart finance, which increases yields, decreases the cost, and ultimately de-risks the issues in farming. And the best thing is that we can scale this globally to all the big cropping areas. Uh, and I think we're open to talking to people who would like to be part of our project. Thank you.